Hi, it's John. It's the 29th of June 2014 and I've just stopped at this lay-by. I thought I'd do a video of the clouds. The clouds are rather fantastic. I'm near... I'm, be I'm between Sherbourne and Yeovil and I just noticed that there's some interesting butterflies about here. Um, there must be a colony of marbled whites here because uh, I've seen about three here and they, they go in colonies. Um, I don't know whether I'm going to be able to actually photograph any but uh, quite interesting isn't it that, um, that they're, they're able to uh, survive the modern way of life you know, on the roadside verge and what, what farmers uh, leave around their fields. Oh, there's a, there's another, there's a, a burnet moth there as well. Uh, I might be able to photograph that, might be easier. Oh, there's another burnet. Um, It's always difficult with the, the viewfinder on daylight today where it's bright. I've rigged up a, some boxes to, um, to, to, to keep the light out. I don't know how I am, but I think I might be on it. It's what's known as a five-spotted burnet. If anybody's counting this, oh, there he is! I can see him on the on the camera, on the viewfinder. Uh, anybody counting the spots? And that plant is known as um, bird's foot trefoil, and. The reason it's called bird's foot trefoil is because the leaves are like a bird's foot. Um, if I can focus on one, which is like a bird's foot. Uh, anyway, you'll have to take my word on that one. So there we are. We've got one one uh, piece of Lepidoptera. A quite cooperative five spotted burn it. See what else I can find. Well, that's rather lucky this marbled white has settled. He's either settled or got himself stuck on the ground. And uh, I'm able to get a nice, nice uh, picture of it. Maybe I'll take some photographs as well. <laughs> 